kind of take things back. We are officially 10 years old as of September. It's our 10th anniversary, and our first Super Crew included Rocky Fenton, Matt Katnick. Matt Katnick had thrown 72 feet his senior year. Datun Ogundeji, he had thrown 65.5 and 194. Nick Ponzio was the 2013 California State Champion, and Kelsey Benoit thrown 62.6 and 185. One of the things most people don't realize is that we started in a really dinky 800 square foot gym, but the perk of it was it was right on Pacific Coast Highway and you looked out the window and you could see the beach and the ocean. It was great. To maximize the space, we had this parking garage below so you could see it's a small gym. So when it was packed and we would have 10, 12, 15 athletes in there, it was pretty jammed. But we also had a dirt lot next door it was one of the things we always talk about. It's uh, not about all the best facilities, it's about the information and the program. And I think, you know, this kind of talks about the early times of what we were able to accomplish. We'd hit some of the local schools, throwing facilities at high schools in Southern California. Nick was one of these guys who would drive, you know, almost an hour and a half one direction to, to come train. Spread your base out. We had this parking garage below. You know, this was the exit of the parking garage is where we used to uh, get a lot of work done. So we would throw into the wall. You can see all the marks on the wall. We knew what we were doing. We were working on our pillars. At this time, we were the very early stages of the throwing chain reaction system. That was it. Better, better. Everybody can see it's better. That's it. And so it was just rep after rep after rep. And it was a great thing to see, you know, just anybody, as long as you can get a hold of a wall, the amount of work you can get done. And I think why, the, you know, what made this group special is that of the five guys, four of them were state champions. So Rocky Fenton was, you know, 158.8 in the shot, very respectable, 185 in the disc. So the California Discus Champion 2014. Yes. Datun would come down fairly regularly, and it's real important to note that Datun's primary coach, the guy who really deserves a ton of credit as well, is uh, Jorge Reyes, who was his school coach and had really gotten Datun up to a really great point. And uh, Datun had come to us in his junior year, and he had three consecutive PR. So him and his coach came down, we coached him up, coach went back, applied the things, Datun PR'd, they came back again, he PR'd again, came back again, PR'd again. Okay, good opener. Load the left and drive, let's go. Push. There you go. Rocky had lived close. Kelsey lived close. They were teammates, really good friends. Went to San Clemente High School, and they lived just a couple miles away. So it was uh, they were they were there, you know, four or five days a week. This way. Smooth. Uh, Katnick lived up in Los Angeles, and so he See, would drive down, better. and we started working with him, and I worked very closely with his coach. His coach is out here in the sector, and he would come to a lot of the trainings and really studied the throwing chain reaction system and applied it with the rest of the throwers at their school. A little better. See, that was actually much better. Whoa. Rocky had worked with since he came in with about 120 foot PR and the next year he had thrown 180 and then by his senior year you know he was consistently in the 170s and the last five weeks of the years we got everything back and he kept PRing every week and he wound up winning the state title. There we go! <laughs> Kelsey Benoit, you know, this guy is probably one of the most talented athletes I've ever coached. His mom was a nutritionist, so he'd eat fantastically, and you know, the kid was just like really talented. At the state meet, unfortunately, he had a little bit of an off day, but he had already thrown well, committed, and all these guys were heavily recruited and scholarship athletes, so it was it was a really fun group to train. After these guys kind of battled it out, you know, they went on, and it was Datun, uh, Matt Katnick, and Nick Ponzio all trained together up in Oregon. Oregon and we went to Junior Nationals. Whoa. There we go. Rocky Fenton. Woo! Hey, Rocky. Turn around. 
the throw 64 4, Matt Katnick. All right, Katnick! Good job! The 2014 California State Track Champion. Cannon from Madison with a throw of 65, 5 and a half. Datun Okudeji. Datun, all right! And Nick had just barely missed the final, I think by a quarter of an inch. He he was a little tight. It was his first big competition in a while. Testament to the athletes, he, these guys were exceptionally talented. These guys, the one common thread was all that they all worked hard. Nick and Datun are basically competing at the pro level. Matt's got one more year due to COVID. He's coming back. And how much fun it was, and you just look back, kind of we come back humbly from humble beginnings. And the importance is kind of putting this video together is just kind of reflect on some of the successes we've had, you know, show you guys some more work we came from and one of our first group of superstars and then we had a whole lot more we're going to be talking a lot more about that in the coming weeks and months and kind of as we celebrate our uh, 10 years of Arite Throws Nation. Mm -hmm.